everybody. I'm Lacey Korn with Peacock Interiors and today I thought I would talk to you about uh, this wallpaper collection called Atelier de Paris. Um, it is a book full of uh, kind of painterly effects, uh, bright colors, and then some modern designs as well. I'll try to make this faster than 10 minutes like the last time. So as you can see from the very first sample, very bright colors. It's almost got a futuristic pattern, but very beautiful. You can kind of see how the light reflects on that paper. It's just got a little bit of sheen and a little bit of, bit of glimmer to it. And then we've got kind of a water, watercolor floral pattern. And then also like a mosaic pattern as well. And then you can kind of see what that sample looks like actually on a wall. And then we've got another sample that just has multiple colors, not in any specific pattern. And then we've got this Moroccan pattern again in red, white, and blue, and it's very pretty. You can kind of see how it looks on the wall. And then more of a play on red, white, and blue. It's just such a pretty color combination. We have almost like an ink watch effect, and then like a cross hatch, and then again that design, futuristic. You know, and it comes in so many different colorways. Here are examples of all the blue. So pretty. It'd be very calming. And if you can see again how this kind of reflects the light, you know, here is gray, you know, beige taupe, you know, even kind of a gold. That'd be very, very pretty. I feel like a kindergarten teacher. And this is very pretty. Over here, I mean, not my favorite, but it has so much dimension and it's got this shimmer on top of it that just really kind of draws your eye in. And this is what I really like, is this flower pattern. And it comes in a bunch of different colors. So here is this, both of these patterns in like an aqua teal color scheme. It'd be very beautiful. <laughs> and then we have, we have lavender. Not my favorite, but there's always someone that out there that, you know, might like something and it would be beautiful on a wall. And then we have this pattern and it's kind of Watercolor trees is almost like an abstract play on trees. It comes in charcoal. And then you can see it also comes in kind of this green jade. And then we have this geometric pattern as well, which has kind of a, like a fun texture to it too. So here is another pattern that's kind of mid-century modern. It's not really my favorite. You can see, but you can see it's got this kind of this shimmer and it would be interesting. I mean, if you see it on this wall, like very mid-century modern. From far away, it's almost a, hun a honeycomb effect. And then we have this tree pattern kind of watercolor and then green and brown. Not exactly my favorite thing in the world, but still could be beautiful in its own way. This is beautiful. This blue, oh, you know who would like this? My mom. My mom would love this. Hint, hint. And then the, there's even this more subtle pattern with the blue. It's very pretty. Uh, 
Oh, this is beautiful. And so then we have this ink blot pattern. And you can kind of see it comes in charcoal and then it comes in that blue and then purple. So it's very pretty. You can kind of see using some very janky lighting today in my beautiful studio, also known as the kitchen. Try not to be distracted by the artwork on the wall. And then we've got some more Moroccan styles here with kind of this pattern underneath a bit. And then a little bit more subdued pattern. And then this is a very interesting pattern. And you'll see towards the end of the book, they have a picture of it um, applied to the wall. This is not something that would normally catch my eye and it looks kind of odd, but if you just give it a second, just give it a second and I'll show you how it looks. We're going back to pops of color here. It's kind of similar to the color scheme I had in my room as a kid, only instead of purple, it was cranberry. And instead of this bright green, it was hunter green. So pretty. You know, we've got kind of like a Southwest color scheme here. Could be very pretty on the wall. You know, this is bold. It'd be, it'd be very eye-catching when you walk in the room. We have same patterns, just grays, beiges, more muted tones. And then this is what I was telling you about. So if you can see, you know, normally I would not be that big of a fan of this, but then I see it applied to the wall and it's so beautiful. There's just so much movement in this pattern and just all the colors it comes in. It just, it's very versatile and it just would add so much and so much dimension to your walls as well. You know, maybe not cover every single wall of this, but certainly one wall would be great. And then we've got kind of the blues and greens. This is a very pretty pattern. You can see just the way the pattern is and the texture. That pattern that was just in the picture. This is very pretty. Just very warm, It'd be beautiful in a bedroom. Ah, I'm gonna lose it. And then here's another floral in pinks. Just so pretty, just so, you know, so beautiful. It'd be really pretty in a bedroom or even in a living room. And then again, same thing, just in grays in warm neutrals. So it's just very versatile. This book has a lot of things to choose from. If you like having a little bit more painterly feel, this would be the book for you. Florals, you know, bold colors, and, um, and actually the 2021 trends of this year do call for very bold wallpaper because I think there's so many people still spending time at home and, you know, why be bored when you're gonna be home all day, every day, working and then living and cooking? So why not go bold? When you're sick of it, scrape it off, go to paint, get another, you know, wallpaper up there. Just do whatever makes you happy. Don't always worry about, you know, being neutral or, you know, thinking about the future, thinking about how something would resell. If you're gonna put up your house up for sale, scrape the wallpaper off or see what they think. I bought a house and scraped the wallpaper off and I hated it, but it didn't hinder my decision to buy the house in the first place. So uh, there's always possibilities. Um, if you want to schedule a wallpaper consultation, just give me a call. My number is 402-750-3906 um, or visit my website, peacockinteriorsne.com. Uh, give me a like if you like this. Let me know if you wanna look at more samples.